Hi guys, it's Chrissy with Chrissy's Divine Design Tarot, and today we are doing a reading for DPR Ian and Future Spouse. Okay, so somebody isn't moving here. Somebody's not coming forward. Let's see what else we got for DPR Ian and Future Spouse. Woo! Hey, hello. So, somebody's getting over a betrayal. That's why they're not going anywhere. We have the Knight of Cups um, wanting to give an offer. I'm wanting that equal give and take, something that's balanced. And maybe somebody who is generous with their money isn't going to hold back. Somebody that they can work with that is cooperative. Somebody that's a team player. Somebody that is going to be... A victory for this person somebody that they feel is a victory that they're getting by asking this person yeah with the ten oh this could mean there might be a deep dark secret here maybe even emotional trauma somebody's gone through here so this could be the person they want to give this cup to. Ooh. Somebody may have some clouded judgment here or be in a fog about somebody else. Maybe not seeing clearly or feeling confused about who to maybe take for an offer. Maybe they have lots of options. But with the eight of cups in reverse somebody isn't walking away though somebody's not really walking away with the eight of cups it's kind of stagnation maybe fear of change I'm feeling maybe they're staying in a bad situation have low self-esteem Let's see, let's clarify what's on the bottom of the deck. Yeah, you're not satisfied with what things are like in your life, possibly at this moment, or this person isn't. So we will clarify, but I do want to get some energy here, energy cards here. Yeah, somebody had a broken heart, and I feel like it had a lot to do with this betrayal here. So... They're suffering from a broken heart. Fourth chakra is the heart chakra may be blocked. So with their heart being broken, they're not willing to maybe step up to put themselves out there again. Yes, there's appreciation here. So somebody is going to appreciate the love that DPR gives them. And it's just... Or they have a deep sense of appreciation for that person. We have blossoms, blossoming abundance. Wow. So by being with this person that appreciates them, it's going to help heal this heart, I feel. A nice blossoming abundance is going to come in. Let's see. Why is the Eight of Wands in reverse, please, Spirit? Why is it in reverse? Mm, there's no more love there. There's that broken heart. So the love is gone. Nobody's moving towards anything here. There's no passion when it comes to a beginning here. Um, not wanting to take that because of getting over some type of... May not be in that state of mind, you know. Not getting those creative hits, those epiphanies for something passionate they may not be passionate about at this time because of what's happened in their life whoa okay so the knight of cups here is with the ten of pentacles and the temperance somebody that's patient kind progressing maybe progressing with their ten of pentacles they may have generational wealth Let's see, what is this equal give and take? Yeah, this is going to be a judgment call for you, uh, DPR, and you're going to have to decide. The Wheel of Fortune is in your favor, and the Six of Pentacles 
came out again. So there's definitely on both sides of this relationship, generosity, loving, um, balanced energy. What is this three of pentacles? Okay. Yeah, somebody's not in a happy home right now with the four of wands in reverse. Um, not able to move with the chariot, not having that win, not winning against some arguments maybe, um, maybe even um, a family feud here. But somebody's trying to cooperate here through all this. What is this victory here? Ah, the Hierophant. So spirituality may be something here or some traditional thinking people have. And, or it could just be wanting a victory with getting married to somebody in particular. So somebody's not seeing something um, or being hung up here, maybe for divine timing, but maybe not having the right perception about somebody. Somebody's not using their intuition either. There may be adultery here or some secrets hidden something here and somebody's in their head about it. What is this ten of wands in reverse? What's this deep dark secret? Mm. Two of swords. This is a truth revealed here. So somebody's truth is being revealed. This deep dark secret that somebody does not want known. Yeah nine of wands in reverse you know i kind of feel like there's going to be some challenges here obstacles here with this deep dark secret this could really um have this person give up on Things. Hopefully not their life because it, nothing's ever that bad to want to cross over, you know. So let's see what else is here. Yeah, Page of Pentacles. Maybe having some financial loss or missing out on a financial opportunity. What's the confusion? Well, this is going to, once they're not confused or they choose something here, they're going to be happy with this. Or something's coming to light, maybe getting them out of this confusion. Yeah, some type of financial. This could be a long-term investment here, heartbreak here. Somebody maybe was confused, didn't pick right when it came to finances. This may be coming to light. Five of Cups in reverse. So I feel like with the Five of Cups in reverse, this is somebody that may be overcoming some despair, moving forward, finding some type of peace in the matter here. We um, Coming out of this heartbreak. This is the Five of Cups in reverse. Yeah, the Queen of Pentacles. So somebody's pentacles are doing better now. They're coming out of whatever this was. And with this stagnation and not able to move forward here, maybe living in the past, they're getting over this. They're getting over whatever this was. What's this? Yeah, Three of Pentacles in reverse. So maybe I'm just not feeling great about things at this point. Hmm. There's, depending on where they are in this journey here, there's things that are really some major things that are going to happen here. Something's going to come to light and it looks like it's going to be part of some type of deception that really breaks somebody's heart here. But they, they still move forward. So it's possible that DPR picked the wrong girl or the girl picked the wrong guy. And they needed to learn a lesson here. So whether it was DPR Ian that chose somebody over their person 
or if their person chose someone else over DPR. It looks like this woman does better as soon as she walks away from whoever this other person is. So it looks like this person may even have been married to this person, but there is heartbreak here. There's no love left. Um, somebody is appreciating what they have. Gratitude, I feel. Maybe trying to open that uh, fifth chakra. Maybe DPR had his open and somebody had theirs closed and didn't take the chance of love here. Um, which is a lesson. And we will have to see what happens next time for DPR and his reading. I do, however, want to maybe do some butterfly cards here and see what other messages come out for DPR. Self-care. Ah, religious and spiritual practices may have been a factor between these two. I also have self-care here. So somebody does not have enough self-esteem um, to move forward. They are having to heal something here. Let's see, hobbies. So maybe they meet through their hobbies. Yeah, do you know, once they get together here, there's gonna be a lot of loving support here. Yeah, this person left. They're not they're not taking the chance. They're not opening that fifth chakra. Let's see. Decisions, yeah. Keeping the faith and end of an era. So I really feel like they ended this with DPR and feeling like it's truly over. We're not going back. This is somebody from his past that he's meant to be with. Grief work. Yeah, I feel like there is a major loss of a feeling here because of the connection and how powerful the connection is. But somebody's not listening to their fifth chakra. And there's forgiveness on the bottom of the deck. And that is maybe the lesson that they have refused to learn. Whether it was DPR or his person, they left they abandoned this relationship uh, for good in a sense but they're just having to do some work here on this broken heart collecting their finances again somebody did a number on this queen of pentacles who is now in um, the upright and doing well with their pentacles that ten of pentacles there somebody tried to maybe swindle her money and it looks like there is some self-esteem issues here that his person needs to deal with. It's possible somebody had really done a number on this Queen of Pentacles in the past, and it may not even have been DPR Ian who broke her heart first, or why she's in the state she is. And it may be that coming back around maybe caused some issues for this Queen of Pentacle to have to do some more work on herself. It's possible DPR Ian needed self-care as well, but in the end, this Queen of Pentacles will forgive DPR Ian. Um, I don't feel like this is the end of all ends, uh, even though the end of an era is here. This may be also to be with belief systems. There could be an end of a certain way of thinking, and that could be why she is going to come back around as forgiveness here. And I love that because forgiveness is huge. She may have to start eating properly too because that was the next card out. So DPR Ian, you may have um, a bit of a tough part here. Um, maybe your person doesn't want to get with you, but there's just keep in mind DPR that they're going through something from someone else or they're reliving what they went through with DPR. So 
and there's some work they needed to do with themselves here in order to have this forgiveness. So we will see about the next reading for DPR. This is quite interesting. I hope you'll stay with me to see the next one. But in the meantime, have a look at uh, all of the playlists that I have. I have celebrity reads, I have full moon and um, new moon readings each month. I have um, the emperor and empress readings for my other channel, which is Chrissy's Divine Design Tea Leaf readings. And also you can check out um, all the weekly readings for the zodiac signs. I do the zodiacs as well and I do the collective read as well. So in any case I'm going to leave it there for DPR and we will talk to you guys next time. Stay blessed. All right later.